Hello everyone, welcome to Ikeda platform and this is Robin Jain here, your electrical faculty and in this video I am I am going to solve the one or you can say the first numerical which is related with your surge impedance loading. Okay, so let's begin with the reading. <music> So what is the say it is given as single phase overload AC line okay it is given single phase overhead AC line and and inductance is given so inductance it means L okay what is the value of L this is given 2 milli Henry so it is 2 milli Henry per kilometer it is given now if I talk about the capacitor so value of capacitor is actually 0.125 okay into 10 raised to power minus 7 and it is given as farad per kilometer it is given as farad per kilometer so let's see what is it is going to ask estimate the surge impedance loading what i have to find surge impedance loading it is actually surge impedance loading so what is the surge impedance loading and what is the formula of this okay this is the power transfer capability i can say and it is actually v square v square upon zs okay and this zs is actually your surge impedance this is zs is actually surge impedance this type of numericals we have already studied in the uh, in the ac systems uh, in the transmission and distribution of ac systems okay surge impedance and that surge impedance is actually l by c okay what is the l value of l as the value of l is given your uh, 2 milli henry so 2 into 10 raised to power minus 3 it is given 0 0.125 into 10 raised to power minus 7 okay so after cancelling out after cancelling out you will get 10 raised to power minus 3 10 raised to power minus 7 10 raised to power minus 4 then it is coming out to be 10 raised to power 2 out of this okay then inside root you are getting 2 upon 0 0.125 125 and i have the answer and it is coming out to be 400 ohm it is coming out to be 400 ohm okay like this now we will talk about now we will talk about this is surge impedance loading so what is actually the surge impedance loading surge impedance loading in the surge impedance loading there is a formula vs square okay surge impedance loading it is a power capability the power is transformed but that power is actually transformed uh, transferred to resistive load how can i say the resistive load okay the surge impedance at uh, that uh, zs is actually representing the traveling of voltage and the current wave and the voltage and current wave are actually in phase why they are in phase because the consumption of reactive okay so i can say reactive uh, a uh, reactive power consumption is actually equal to the reactive power con uh, reactive power generated in the generating side so ultimately uh, that is cancelled out and we will left with the ohmic value that is the resistive load and that sil is v square and that is voltage is given as your 400 kilometer uh, 400 kilovolt so 400 into 400 v square is given so 10 raised to power kilo okay so 10 raised to power 3 to power 2 so it is coming out to be and divided by 400 so cancelling 400 400 you are getting 400 mega watt value so i hope this numerical you have understood successfully thank you